What are you doing today, hair? Pick a side, pick a side. Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I literally have a table full of makeup here. These are my favorites under five bucks. Now this can go up to $5.99. It's not gonna go over six. These are all cruelty-free items. I got them um, at CVS and Ulta. So let's go ahead and dive right in. Okay, so starting with the face, uh, Wet n Wild, of course, their Photo Focus Foundation. This sucker retails for $5.99. It comes in a glass bottle. It's full coverage. It's beautiful. It lasts throughout the day. Everything layers wonderfully on top of it. I literally have nothing bad to say about this foundation. It is amazing. And moving right along to eyes, this also is from Wet n Wild. This is one of their 10 pan eyeshadow palettes. This one is Rose in the Air. It literally is $4.99. The blendability on these is amazing. The pigmentation is ridiculous. Um, and they just swatch beautifully. So you can see that's $5. Everybody thinks this is a dupe for the Anastasia of Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette. That one will set you back, I think $42. Again, this is five. Okay, so liquid eyeshadows. Everybody's coming out with the metallic shimmery liquid eyeshadows and a lot of the prestige brands, literally it'll set you back like 24 bucks. This is from Wet n Wild. This is their liquid catsuit eyeshadow. It retails for $4.99. Oh my goodness, this is the shade Shells and Whistles. Look at that metallic wet shine. Oh, these blend perfectly. They give you just the right amount of time to pat, pat, pat it in so you're not stuck with it like clumping on just one part of your lid. You definitely have time to blend. Now these are from Catrice. This is their liquid metal eyeshadow. And I think they're actually phasing these out for their heavy metals, which is a shame because these were beautiful too, also under five bucks. This is the shade Champagne Shower. Very similar, similar formulation to the one from Wet n Wild. Just that perfect timing in terms of blendability. And then this is in the shade California Creamin, also from Catrice. Boom, like, oh my gosh, have you ever seen anything so beautiful under five bucks? When it comes to mascaras, this is from Essence. It's their Forbidden Volume Formulation. Uh, this is another one, I think, unfortunately. Uh, good luck if you can find it, but that brush literally is just like the Too Faced Better Than Sex. In fact, hold on, I will show you. All right, so here's the brush from Essence. This literally, I think, was like $3.99. And here's the brush from Too Faced. This is $23. So can you tell the difference? I cannot. Um, the formulation on the Essence is amazing. It allows you to build, build, build. It does not clump. It does not flake. It holds its place on your eyelashes all day long. You cannot beat it. I know they're definitely still selling this on Essence's website. It's also on Amazon, strangely enough, for like a buck 12, but then they charge you 4.95 shipping, but it's definitely worth checking out. If you're looking for a really good brow gel, but don't wanna pay like 20 some dollars uh, to keep those hairs in place, check out the NYX Control Freak. This is 5.99, so just under six bucks. It literally looks like just a clear mascara. And once you're done applying your brows, I just lightly go over them with this. It holds in place all day long. It doesn't give you that like crusty brow situation. It's really, really nice. I literally just had a heart attack. My camera just boop, flipped back. I thought it was going to break. So if the angle's weird, that's why. So moving right along to highlighters. Both of these are from Essence. I've got the liquid highlighter. This is their Make Me Glow. And then I also have the powder highlighter. This is in the shade Pure Nude. This is 450, this is 550. Both of these are absolutely gorgeous. The Make Me Glow I love because it literally is like this eh, pinky pearly shade, which you don't find a lot of. Like, look at that. It's just this really nice peachy pinky. Did I say pinky purpley earlier? <laughs> if I did, I meant to say peachy pinky. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful liquid highlighter. Blends really well, stays in place all day. Um, the Pure Nude is just that. It's just this really, really pretty nude shade. Let's see. Eh. So obviously you're not gonna have as much of an oomph with a liquid highlighter, but 
you know, if you want more, there you go. If you want more of a wet look, this is buildable, it's beautiful, and hey, for five bucks, can't go wrong. Okay, and next from Wet Wild, I literally have talked about these gel liners at least 10,000 times. These are $2.99, they're amazing. I've got the shades Bear to Comment, which is my go-to. I've got Red the Scene, which is a beautiful scarlet, and then Gone Burgundy. Now, be careful with these. They are very, very soft, um, but one swipe and you are there. I mean, they're just so pretty. They last a long time. I mean, they're not gonna last like some ridiculous amount of time, like a couple days, even like a full day, but they'll definitely get the job done. Super creamy, very easy to apply, no skipping like a traditional liner has a tendency to do. Just very, very pretty. And again, for three bucks. And finally with lips, oh my goodness, this is from Essence, their Water Kiss Glossy Lip Color. Before I tell you how much this is, I'm just going to swatch it for you. You will die. Look at this. Look at that pigmentation. It is beautiful. This is in the shade Deep Sea Love. I have two of these. I can't find where the other one is. This is $3.49. It's ridiculous. It gives this beautiful stain to the lips. You've got the gloss. It's so comfortable. You can't feel it on. It's lightweight. Oh my lord. This literally is like the best formulation I've ever found for a stain gloss combination. So that is it, my favorites under five. If you know of a favorite under five that you would like me to try, leave it in the comments below. And I think I'm gonna do another one of these, my favorites under 10, because I have another pile that I could share. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.